With roots in Manitoba going back 125 years, the law firm of Thompson, Dorfman, Swetman shares a long history with our province and its people. The firm was founded in 1887 by Isaac Campbell and John Huff. The two young lawyers opened a modest office on Main Street and within a few years had built a successful practice. In 1891, Isaac Campbell became the first president of the Manitoba Bar Association. He was also a close friend of Wilfrid Laurier and hosted author Mark Twain when he came to Winnipeg on a lecture tour in 1895. In addition to being one of Winnipeg's most prominent lawyers, John Huff was well respected for his philanthropic and community work. He was president of Winnipeg General Hospital for a number of years and was also a founding member of St. Charles Country Club. In 1903, the firm took on a new partner, Albert Ferguson from Souris, Manitoba. A short time later, Huff, Campbell and Ferguson moved from Main Street to a larger space on Portage Avenue in the newly built Northern Crown Building. By the time Canada formally entered the First World War in 1914, Huff, Campbell and Ferguson had established itself as one of the largest and most reputable commercial law firms in Manitoba. Despite the hard economic times, the firm managed to grow during the war. Elmer Diltz and Edwin Godfrey Phipps Baker became partners in 1919. Phipps Baker was one of the many World War I veterans to join the firm. He was a true war hero, receiving both the Distinguished Service Order and Military Cross. He subsequently married the daughter of firm founder John Huff in 1921. Elmer Diltz likewise became a prominent lawyer and citizen of Manitoba. He was a gifted speaker and served the Canadian Bar Association as its Manitoba lecturer. In 1914, Diltz became counsel for the National Talking Machine Company, a Winnipeg-based manufacturer of talking machines, better known as phonographs. The second generation of the firm had proven it was just as driven as the first, and Huff, Campbell, Ferguson, Diltz and Baker was emerging as one of the most prominent legal firms in Western Canada. Today, the Thompson-Dorfman-Swetman boardrooms bear their names, paying homage to our founding partners. <laughs>